guys, this is Leslie from Leslie Loves Veggies, and I just got home from picking up my little guy from school, and in my mailbox was my birch box for February. So I figured, let me just do an unboxing real quick and see what's in the box. So I just split open the outer box, but I haven't looked at the inside box yet. This is what it looks like. It's very pretty. It's kind of an um, like a fluorescent orange with purple um, speech bubbles. Now, I don't know what they're going to do, but Birch Box has told everybody to save their boxes from the year. And if you recall, past Birch Boxes used to be just in a brown cardboard box, and now they're in these cute little boxes each month. So I don't know what they're going to do, but I'm saving my boxes. I have um, nail polish in one box. I have um, some mascaras in another box. So I've been using them, and I think they're really cute, and they're cute to display instead of that plain cardboard box. So the theme for this month is Get Gorgeous on Us. And it says, score a free Benefit Cosmetics, the Professional Primer Deluxe Mini. And they give you the website with any full-size purchase through the 26th of February. So I'll check that out. Um, this is what's in my box. Uh, can you see that? And this is the back of the card. And it says, calling all buddies, pals, partners in crime and BFFs, February may, may be about a certain romance-focused holiday. But we're just as thrilled to celebrate those who prefer people who cheer us on. And, you know, I love Valentine's Day. I really do. But um, I love it as much for celebrating, you know, the family love and love of my children and my grandchildren as much as romantic love of my husband. So I, just a nice holiday to me. There's a couple holidays that I don't care for, like Halloween. But I really do enjoy Valentine's Day. So what's in the box? Let's get right to it. The first thing is a, and I think it's pronounced Perlier, White almond um, body butter, I guess. My lighting is off because it's getting to be that time of the day, sun setting. So um, I might not be able to have the most perfect picture, but I just wanted to show you what was in the box. I'm a nut for, for body butter. It has a very mild scent. I have so many open lotions and body butters, but I will be honest with you, I use them like they're going out of style. I always keep a, um, a lotion or a cream in my purse because my hands are just so dry. I have Sjogren syndrome and my eyes are dry. Um, my lips are always chapped. I just have very, very dry skin. So this is nice. I like that it's a light scent. Um, I can use all of my, my hands and my body, so that's nice. Next in the box is a, uh, hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Oh, okay, it's shampoo. It says, Dear Clark, um, I don't know where it says rejuvenating, dry, overstressed hair, shampoo for hair. Dear Clark, ready to replenish? Okay, so it's a shampoo. And I like this. It came with a conditioner also. So it's the conditioner and the rinse. Um, and it's, I can't read the writing. It's so tiny, I can't really, really read it. But it looks like it's for troubled hair, overstressed hair, which... I got overstressed hair. Now, I'm lucky this didn't leak because this lid was not on. Oh, very tight. That's herbally. It smells so pretty. Almost like, I want to say rosemary. It smells really good. Let's smell the conditioner. Same. That smells really nice. I like, I don't, I'm not a fan of tinfoil packets. I got tinfoil packets of another brand of shampoo. And I think it was my birch box. I know a lot of people don't like getting shampoo. I love getting shampoo. Now, the tinfoil packet was from another brand, another company called Davines which I'm familiar with, and although it was a tinfoil packet, there was enough in there for me for two or three, even four shampoos, because their shampoo is so concentrated. But I like receiving these little bottles, because when we travel, I can bring these bottles with me and not have to rely on um, hotel shampoos, which are notoriously, you know, not that great. So I like that. Those are nice. Okay, birch box. The pillow pack, every month, I'm going to say it until you stop doing it. This is a waste of paper. It's a waste of cardboard. It's a waste of resources. You know, I'm an eco-friendly kind of girl. Please, stop using these. We don't need these. This is a waste of paper. That being said, let's see what's in the pillow pack. Now, I, I buy this on my own. Birchbox is not sponsored this, so um, and all opinions on my own. Even if they were sponsoring this, I would still say dump the pillow pack. Okay. Um, the next thing in the, in the box is a Laura Geller Glam Flash, Glam Lash Dramatic Volumizing Mascara. I have a bunch of mascaras. The one I'm using right now 
I received from Pop Sugar, and it is it was a mystery mascara, mystery curl mascara, and it wound up being Benefit Roller Lash, and I really like it. So I'm going to use, and that's a full size tube. So I'm going to use that up. Um, see before I open up any more mascaras. But I have a Laura Geller palette that I love. I have a Laura Geller blush that I love. So it's a really good product, and I really enjoy that. Okay, the next thing, and I I used to not like getting perfumes in my birch box or my Ipsy bag because I just thought what a waste. But lately I've been like really experimenting with different fragrances, finding what I like. And so I don't mind getting them as much anymore as long as they're not a little tiny little nothing or a tinfoil packet would really pez me off bad. I'll be honest with you. This is Hello, Hello, Hello by Harvey Prince. And I have quite a few of their um, fragrances. I just finished up a big, huge bottle of Ageless, which I loved. And I think they have one called Flirt, which I really liked, and one of my kids stole that from me. <sighs> Ridiculous. But the inside of the, the, inside of the little um, packet says, you had me at hello. You had me at hello. And this is supposed to be uh, oh, Meyer Lemon Mandarin and Grapefruit. I'm such a sucker for citrus. I love citrus. My daughter hates citrus. And it says, because citrus is nature's way of saying... Good morning. Um, and it's got forsythia because they are an early spring floral, a welcome sign of a new beginning and possibilities. And plumeria because the flowers are traditionally used in Hawaiian, Hawaiian lace given to greet friends old and new. I'm not a big fan of sweet smelling perfumes. And I think I do like plumeria. Um, I have perfume on a race, so I hate to, but I'm, I got to try it. It might be so, so fabulous. Let's try it. Come on, you. If this is broken, I'm not going to be a happy camper. Oh, there we go. It's not citrusy. It has citrus notes to it. I thought it would be mostly citrus and less floral. It smells fruity. Very florally. It's a beautiful scent, but I wouldn't say the predominant notes are citrus. They are not. I was expecting a very lemony, zingy, zesty. No, it's a... Pretty, floral, fruity smell. And it's beautiful and I do like it. It's something that I would purchase. I love it. I, you know, the reason I do like getting perfumes is because the seasons change and I wear, wear a heavier perfume in, in the winter, in the cooler months, and I wear a lighter perfume in the summer months. And even at night, sometimes if I go out in the summer, I'll put something that's a little bit more, you know, sultry on. So I do like trying perfumes before I buy them because if I don't, I want to wear the same perfume for years and I never change and I, it winds up being you know, kind of dating me. And I like that some women you can smell and say, oh, that's so-and-so scent. I'm kind of more go with the flow, change my perfume with my mood, change my perfume for the occasion. I just like to experiment. I like things that smell nice. So this is very nice, and I really do like it. Birchbox is $10 a month. For $10 a month, I mean, you can't go wrong. I haven't had to really buy mascara in ages because and I know a lot of people don't like getting mascaras or eye pencils. I love it. I just love makeup and I like trying new things. If I like it, I will buy it. So in this month's birch box was I received a perfume. Hello, hello from um, Harvey Prince. I received a Laura Geller Glam Lash um, Dramatizing, Dramatic Volumizing Mascara. This is almost full size. It's not, but it's probably like three quarter size. I received, and I don't know the price and how much these are full size, but these probably will give me two or three shampoos and conditions, dear Clark shampoo and conditioner, and a Perlier White Almond um, body butter. So that's very, very nice. Ten bucks. I've got to say, like I've said in the past couple months, I um, I had stopped Birchbox for a while because I, was, I wasn't happy with them. You know, tinfoil packets. Um, I just didn't like what I was getting. I stopped, and then I said, let me just try it again. And I'm so glad I did. I've been receiving it now for, I don't know, four or five months, and I've loved every single box. I mean... I didn't love it so much last year, and I said, I'll oh, stop. It was easy to stop. None, no shenanigans, no carrying on, no texting, no, no emailing, no calling. We stopped. That's it. Started, restarted. So I like the fact that their customer service is amazing. You know, if you've got a problem, they address it immediately. If you want to stop, you can stop immediately. You can restart immediately. There's no... No jumping through fiery hoops, and that's what I really like about Birchbox, and I like the fact that they've really stepped up their game. I don't. I, I like to compare Birchbox to Ipsy because each is ten dollars. I love my Ipsy because I like 
the bag each month, and I use my makeup bags. I like the products. They're, you know, they're not as high end as Birchbox. Um, so I like getting higher end products that I can try because I won't buy a high end product without really trying first. I can't afford that. Ipsy is more, I don't want to say dollars, I don't want to say dime store, but it's more um, uh, like every day, you know, you might get a Pixie mascara, you might get um, um, NYX eyeshadow. It's not as high end and you usually get maybe a bigger size. Either way, they're both great. $10 a month, you can't pass that up. So if you like um, Birchbox and you like to subscribe, I'll put my referral link down below. If you'd like to use it, that's fine. If you don't want to use it, that's fine too. But if you do like my video, please give me a thumbs up, not a thumbs down. And be sure to subscribe. Thank you guys. Bye.